Okay, folks, we are back. The way I have it on my scorecard so far, the bumper sticker and the weenie got the big laugh for the night. <laughs> Recently, folks, I happened to see this on CNN, the 11th annual international... It is an international. Aha. Uh -huh. Sorry. Uh -huh. Aha. I said, was it international? And you said, no. We could have billboarded this. We didn't have this in the paper, did we? It was international. You see, when you have a national whistle off, a lot of people say, eh, we've seen that. <laughs> This is the International Whistle Off. It was held in Carson City, Nevada, and we invited a few of the uh, winners tonight. Would you welcome Roy Thorson, LaVey Kildall, and Sean Lomax. Would you come out, please? <laughs> Let's see if I have the order here. You're, you're Sean. Yes. You place first in... Classical. Classical. And did I pronounce your uh, name right? LeVay? LeVay, yes. LeVay Kildow? Or Kildow. Kildow. And you were, um, where did, I, where did I have it? You also were in Classical, right? Yes. And uh, Roy placed as Grand Champion. I'm afraid so, yes. Well, congratulations <laughs> to all of you. Uh, I assume you, you know each other. Yes. Then? Yeah, we competed uh, this year, and we've competed since 1985 yeah. with each other, and... Uh, we all arrived at the airport, and I've known Sean from three whistle-offs and LeVay from a couple. Do you, do you ever steal from... Do you ever get nervous when you see what somebody else is doing? Uh, that, you know, there might be whistling better than you are that particular year? He's practicing my song that I'm going to do tonight. You're kidding. <laughs> yeah, we're, back, we're backstage doing each other's tunes. Yeah. How did you get started in this? Either one of you. Roy, how did you start? Well, uh, I've been whistling as long as I can remember. I started when I was six and practiced for 40 years, and then before I stepped on stage in Carson City. Yeah. And, uh, and then I all of a sudden realized I, uh, I had the performer bug, and yeah. uh, away we went. LeVay, how about you? <clears throat> I've been whistling since I was four years old, and uh, never thought about champion whistling until I met Roy at the Expo in Vancouver. British Columbia in 86. Yeah. I, was, uh, I was performing he... there, and she was in the audience, and here she was puckering up, and I saw her, so I just went. I became and up so she caught came. up in the emotion of the poet and I, which Roy was whistling. Yeah. Is that the way you recognize that you see a, a pucker? Oh, yeah. When, oh. I see, when I see a girl, when, when, when I see a girl puckering up, I respond off. every time. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Sean, how about you? Well, I started out when I was really, really young. My grandmother you said started I started young. whistling before I could talk. Yeah. Yeah. She, yeah. So, what is the secret to good? I have never been able to whistle out by blowing air out. I whistle by bringing the air in. Is that wrong? No, no, I do both. In other I, words, you can I be, do uh, out and in at the same time. Just, so you don't have to take any beat. You can just. No, I can just keep sustaining out for indefinitely until. Yeah, now you're in the navy. You're stationed on the uh, ship. Uh, USS Buffalo. It's a submarine out submarine. of Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. Now, that's... Good for you. Thank you. How long have you been in the service? I've been in the service now uh, 10 years. Yeah. 10 now, years submarine since I was 18. Is, submarines are, are rather confining. Uh, <laughs> what's, the compliment of, what's the compliment of a submarine? Uh, we have... Uh, if it's not a secret. Uh, we have over 100 people on board. Yeah. yeah. Now, when you're whistling in a submarine, and there's not... <laughs> you practice there? No, no, no. Uh, the whole point of submarine is to be stealth. So, you know, we have to be quiet. So when we're underway, secure the whistling. And you can go out for months, right? Yeah, yeah. Once yeah, and time. when you got 100 guys in the sub, you probably don't feel like whistling after a few months. <laughs> <laughs> That's not something you would want to yeah. walk around doing a lot of. <laughs> okay, we're going to take a break here, and then we're going to have each of you uh, do, I guess, what you did on the, uh, on the whistle-off, right? Yes. Okay, we'll, we'll take a short break and come in right back. Okay. We have uh, three of the winners from the International Whistle Off in Carson City, Nevada. I'm going to introduce them, and then they'll perform in that order. The first would be Roy Thorson, LeVay Kildo, and Sean Lomax. So, Roy, it's all yours.
Absolutely dynamite. That is incredible. That's puck, pucker power. Pucker power. I, I could not believe you could get that kind of sound out of a human being. You're, you're all marvelous. Thank now, you. the audience, before you came out, started to whistle, so we're going to give you a chance, folks. <laughs> Let's hear what... Try the theme song of The Tonight Show. Dot, 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 dot. All ready? One, two, three, go. <laughs> you folks stink. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.